Hello everyone and welcome to today's video where we are going to talk about the digestive system of a cow and other ruminants. The first thing you need to know is that a cow has four stomach. Four stomach, sorry. The first one is known as the reticulum. The second one is known as the rumen. The third one is known as the omasum. And the last one is known as the abomasum which is the final stomach and which looks more uh, which looks similar as compared to the human stomach okay so all these stomachs contain enzymes that help to break down whatever the cows consume into what nutrients that can be utilized by the body okay dairy breeds that produce a lot of milk have the digestive system that has been altered to have larger stomachs so that they can be able to consume more okay so the first stomach is known as the rumen where fermentation occurs when a cow consumes grass the first thing that is done is that the grass is taken to the rumen where it ferments then after it ferments the cow will bring it back into the mouth and consume and now break it down by chewing and it will swallow for the second time okay so you need to know that the rumen has a solid mass and a liquid layer okay so that when the grass goes there it goes into a solid mass then on top of that there will be a liquid layer of water that allows the solid mass to ferment okay then having the four stomachs allows a cow to consume things like grass that human beings cannot consume okay so inside the digestive system of the cow we have enzymes such as we have enzymes such as acetic acid propanoic acid and butyric acid which allows the cow to break down carbohydrates to form fatty acids that can be utilized by the cow okay it also allows the cow to break down proteins to form amino acids which can be utilized by the cow okay so that's all about the digestive system of the cow see you in the next video as we continue to talk about farming